Hello everyone and welcome to Steven and Friends. Today we are taking a look at a, uh, a new recently released game called Inkbound. It's actually still in early access and uh, I got some keys from a friend of mine who was on the development team. So appreciate it. Thank you Mohammed, for sending those keys over. Uh, today I'm joined with Alex, Dan, and Hal and we're going to jump into the world of Inkbound. It's uh, a cooperative turn-based roguelike. And I'm curious I to find out what bound. that means. What are you? I am... Never mind. I am Inkbound. I'm a cooperative turn-based roguelike. Oh, that's yeah, what... Oh. I get the reference. So, hold on. Where Where is everybody? I want to see what everyone made. Okay, I'm so... I'm Spooderman. Wow, you really are. Yeah. That's pretty great. The, 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 the character customization is great so dan and alex are both the the magic user and how is the nature user and i'm the lava user it looks like it yeah okay all right let's gate keep <laughs> let's gate keep. oh no let's not okay so i accepted the inkwell dive we gotta go up to up to the there's up. also the bindery and the repository where these things do I'm sorry, did you say the depo the suppository? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, the repository. It remains drained, thirsty for ink. Oh. Yeah, yeah, Alex is right. Up up above, you got unranked and ranked. Oh, we should probably do unranked. Let's do unranked. All right, unranked dive. It has dive. an arrow on it. So do I, what do I do? Click on unranked, unranked. dive. Okay. And then... Once, I guess once we've all done it, we get sucked in. Yeah. Oh, that's a sploosh. Oh, I got splooshed. All right. Hey, we're all here. The Sea of Ink. <laughs> this already works better than Grand Theft Auto Online. <laughs> 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 we all loaded into the same room. Maybe Excellent. it's this way. Who's this guy? Always a welcome sight to see another one of you running around our worlds. Okay, you can call it's me the scribe. Okay. Should I just listen? Listen. As you approach hey. the, <laughs> as you approach the edge of the sea of ink, um, your quill picks up the trails of stolen ink. So we're trying to get ink. Okay. Ooh, which one of these things do we want to kill? Argolath. Ooh. Argolath, I like Argolath. Cinder or Shadow of the Runestone. Run. Run. Um a hundred thousand damage. So, I guess that's a lot of damage. Maybe Argolath. He's on the left, which means that it's easier. Okay. All we have to do is visit a guy instead of killing stuff. What's this? That makes sense. The Superior Vault. Ooh. Call forth a vestige. Uh, why? Oh, we can re-roll. Yeah, but it takes your points. You have 150 points. The I'm augments gonna... for me are plus 10 damage, plus 20 damage, or plus 30 damage. <laughs> I wonder which one I should choose. Plus 10. Okay, so are these tomes, like, choosing which area we go to? It kind of sounds like it. you got Vengewood, Silent Promenade, or the Radiant Market. Ooh. Oh, I understand. So when you augment oh. the binding, those are just different. These are your moves. Mm. I understand. So, like, even though... Because, like, on my Scorching Leap, it says inflict three stacks of burn, and Smash is five, but also it's a different move. Like, Leap is jumping through the air. So, of course, it's going to do... And it has, like, a bigger area of effect, so, of course, it's only going to do three stacks. I understand. Alex, how are you sitting down? I use the emotes in the bottom. The bottom of the UI. Oh. Spider-Man gonna sit. Uh, the Venge would? Oh, Dan, you're so funny. Why not the Radiant Market, where there are evils from the depths? Okay, that's fine. Market. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Market. Oh, that's cool. Enter into a is new this, world. Is this Platoon? Ooh, there's boxes. Okay, so there's nothing else here. If it's like, uh, it looks like there's Easter eggs everywhere. Combat encounter. It doesn't really matter. This will be our first group combat. Oh, I'm excited. Yeah. 
Spooder man, spooder man. Oh, okay. Uh, are you ready we to ready? engage? Position yourselves. I mean, I like how it doesn't start until we're all ready. Mm. Okay, so. Okay, there's. Oh, those are ink pens. And power orbs. And there's also. Yeah, I'll take one of these power orbs. There's still, an, there's still two other ones. Oh, God, I can't move into. Oh, I can. All right, let me do okay. a smash. And I'm out of juice, so I'm gonna get out of the. Is this the attack range? Uh. Yeah, I believe it's their attack range. It's very interesting that you can walk through. Oh, but you can take. It looks like you take damage in real time if you walk through the goo. Oh, there's ooze. Avoid yeah. the goo. Sorry, it popped up a tooltip to tell me about the goo, so I was standing in the goo for a while. <laughs> oh, yeah, now I'm standing in the goo. I don't love the oh. goo. You still yeah. have bar, don't you? Well, yeah, but... Yeah, like so the so the, the blue bar is your... So the red bar is your health, and then the blue bar is your will. And you want to use up all of your will, generally, on your turn, and then mark that you're done, and then once we've all marked done, then it moves into the next session. Okay, I marked done, and it's... That was okay. me. There we go. Secret of the Ooze. The purple goop is Blight. All right. I'm starting to get feel for this a little bit. Oh, I... No, oh dear. I'm making friends with this dude. Someone could... All right. Do I still have one? I still have one. I can kill it. Okay. Nice. And then I'm done. Eh. It only, it only like, just dawned on me that, like, I can't... Like, movement exerts will... Even yeah. though they told me that. I can't move outside of this ring. Okay. So and I'm again. I'm I'm starting to understand a little bit better. Oh, that's bad. Oh, the goop is moving in. Controlled weaving. Oh, we did All it. Right. I so, did the final font, blow. The font of wisdom. So I think I, I think I, I get it a little bit better. I was not even though they told me like movement will use your will, like I had completely forgotten. And I was like, why don't I have any will? And it's because I'm just oh, running around the we're still hurt, and one of the uh, powers I can choose is to heal myself, so. Okay. Yeah, I have that too. I so, didn't lose oh, very much. Oh, that's right. This is a roguelike, huh? Correct. Yes. We're going to So die. we have to see how far we can get. Um, um, you increased your stats. I'm getting very frosty. I like that. I, I'm frosty. Uh, on my first turn, I inflict four stacks of frostbite to all enemies. Anytime I get hit, I inflict frostbite. If I give, if I inflict threaded on an enemy, then it will get frostbite too. So we're gonna frost it up good. Okay. Um, Common I can poison people. That should be fun. Come so on. So do these squirt, do these do these augments replace previous augments, or are they stacked? No, I don't think so. I think they stack. They stack like pancakes. Because okay, We're at the IHOP, baby. So my current scorching smash uh, has five. So if I choose this, yeah, it's okay. No, they stack. All right, which I guess makes sense, right? Because if it's a rogue like you want to keep getting better. Got it. You can also keep your stats on the side open if you just want to see what your stats are. Oh, I got a fish. What? Nice. I just got a fish. You can fish. Keep eye out for fishy. Ooh, Draft the fish binding. will provide a powerful boon. Okay, so this is a new ability that we get to pick. I thought we just picked new abilities already. No, I like get... completely. They call them binding, so they'll take up slot four. We augments to our existing abilities. Yeah, now the... we get new ability. I'm going to call them powered, powered Yeah, so, so far we've augmented one through three, and now this is a, this is number four. This is like a completely new ability. I am Ooh, better understanding. Don't forget the potions. Oh, oh my yeah. god, there's a there's potions on the left. There's stuff everywhere. Sure. Calvin will be going healer. Quilling. All right, uh. let's see here. Um, Watch out for frostbite. 
So at the beginning, the ring, is that showing me like how, like the purple ring, is that showing me I'm going to take damage within this ring? Yes. Yeah, I that's, think so. that's showing that I'm going to get hit. Got it. Purple ring. Okay. Um, um. I can do an astounding okay. amount of damage with this. So I'm going to do that. Do it. <laughs> it's not even that <laughs> Just great. Just a bit. And then I'm also going to plant... Where can I plant this? Anywhere? I'm going to plant this over here. Is that is that pot friend? D it it cult is pot cultivated friend. plant. Uh, and my turn's over. I'm going to call him pot friend. <laughs> the thing that I put on the ground? Oh, there's another one. No, the the thing that just shat, that shat frostbite. Click when in range to collect. All right, so I get extra I get extra will now, which is cool. Um, let's do. Oh, I'm gonna get hit bad. <laughs> well, don't do that. <laughs> do y'all want me to leap over there and help out with that? Check this out. Oh wow! Ooh, nice. Um, Don't forget you can eat your fish. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you forget about fish. Um, um, I, I don't need I'm to collect good. these power orbs. Oh, I guess I could kill that guy over there if I walk over there. Is he dead? He's not dead. No. He's still not dead. Pro tip, if you hold shift, you can look around without moving. Okay. Oh yeah. Um, let me take one of these power orbs so I can walk out and of the circle. Alt will show the names of things. There we go. Yeah, I'm starting to become accustomed to what's going down here. Oh, they moved. Um. Oh god, I'm out of juice. You're out of juice? I don't have a lot of juice to work with here. Oh, I got more juice. Um, is that it? That's it for me. What's this thing? Left click consume, reduce all cooldowns by three. Um, I don't need to do that this turn. Oh, I wish we could kill that, that one boy. Uh, yeah, I can't do that yet. But we can't. Oh god! Yeah, he's gone. He's gone. So is the. Okay. Um. All right. Let me do. I definitely want to do a smash. There we go. And then. Take advantage of those power orbs if you're near them. Um. They give you power. What power orbs? The the there will be like blue that appears on the ground, and we can take them, and it gives us one additional will. Mm. Um, I'm standing in the goop. Yeah, don't don't be the, standing in goop I'm at gonna, the end of your turn. I'm gonna maybe not do that. I'm gonna well, like walk my fish over, and it walk didn't over do here. Anything. Is this safe? Um, I'm still gonna take damage. Can I walk? Can that, I that? That, that's if you if you get hit. It's not a health thing. So right now, over here, it says six. So it looks like I'm going to take six damage. Is that true? I think so, yeah. Because I'm at 39. I'm going to hit play or, like, done because yeah, I'm done with my says, turn. Yeah, because mine has two. Yeah, so that that's, that's indicating, like, how much damage you're going to take from it. So Alex is getting really low on health. Yay. Restore health. I, that's all I can do. Man, I could get plus five frostbite damage for all my frostbite stuff. Yeah, but if you're dead, it's a real good synergy. <laughs> but I really do need to. I'm also get taking. Those um, points. I'm taking health. Yeah, same. Ooh, we got quillings. Uh, is that experience? I don't know what that I is. I think it's money. Augment. That's yeah. I think good. the quillings is like the currency. Okay, okay I'm gonna get this thing that gives me shield. Okay. There's also, good. 
If you look at your bindings, there's three small circles, and that's to indicate what level of augment you have on that binding. So it looks like the maximum you can augment any particular binding is three. And I've already got one at level two. Same. Uh, no more fishing. Oh, Ooh, we, we could to... heal and spend some of our money. And get one out, one out of our three carver visits. For, for I which vote, one? I vote we heal and, and go to the shop. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like a good plan for Alex. Any hey. fish? No, no fish. Are hurt too. So there's the carver, the, carver. the store, restore 15 HP, which it costs 75. Oh. Um, I actually am I not gonna, have... I'm not going to heal because I'm okay. Store of value. I love going to the local store of value. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the store of value. Oh, yeah, and it one. also grants plus 10 maximum HP. Oh, that's neat. Yeah, I'll do that. So my HP got bigger. So we have to visit the Carver three times in this run to do the special objective. Which, like... Well, be by. Okay. I, um, I don't think I'm going to buy anything. It doesn't seem... I mean, that's that's fair. Okay, do we want common or uncommon? <laughs> we should probably stick with a common encounter. But no, at least we might get still. good rewards. I, I mean, yeah, but we also are trying to live. <laughs> it's true. Living is great. Anything else? Potion supply. Here? Potion. Where potion? Potion. Uh. Oh shoot! I walked past that. Oh, you can have two hey, potions. Do y'all do, do, do oh. see this right here? This potion. Yep. Yeah. Or. Well, no. If you got a potion out, we we don't see that, but we see the thing, and we get our own. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, everyone gets their own potion, and you can you have two potion slots. Is there a fish? I didn't see a fish. No fish. I'm um. Finally, understanding the game, in a in a rudimentary fashion. Ru yeah, I'm I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it. I really love that Dan is Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's great. <laughs> like I look over on the left, and it's just a picture of Spider-Man's head. Spider Dan, Spider Dan. Oh, lots of whatever a Spider-Man um, does. So let's see. I've got four of this. Let's start by and because you know how much damage you're gonna get hit. Like that's helpful to know. Like if you want to use a shield or not. Uh, I'm gonna plant this. Um, on the field, and then well, I'm I did, gonna. I did good damage to these two pots. Oh, I have I'm to pick myself. one. I'm gonna do this Does fella. The two. Huh. Okay. Um, I've got one left. Yeah, let's do this. Okay. Um. And. I'm just gonna take damage and that's fine. I'll take four All right. damage. Alright, cool. There you go. Oh, one's down. Nice. I didn't Not a fan of them scattery pot guys. Um Oh, I'm about to take twenty nine damage, so that's bad. Let me <laughs> maybe not take um... twenty nine damage. Wait, if I kill this I I can't kill that. Is my plant dead? <laughs> they killed my plant. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Those bastards. <laughs> they killed my plant. I'm going to move over here. Oh, they're all targeting me. Yeah, it's not good for you. Be. Oh, you are the tank. I'm I the think. tank. Okay, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to consume a shield potion, which will help a little bit. Um, okay. And then let me uh, at least do like this little, little dirt dirt bag. All right, that's it. I'm gonna. I'm bag. just. I'm just gonna take six, I guess. Jesus. I'm, I'm gonna ask again. Is this platoon? <laughs> uh, yeah. Everyone is targeting me at all times, so that's cool. Um, 
we are incentivized to make the pain go away. Uh, I can hit all of these guys. Oh no, I can't reach. But only a little bit. I'm done. Uh, let's see. That's not quite done. I want to do. Then uh, can you get orb? Orb. Oh. Okay. Now um, you can do a thing again. Oh, what about oh, yeah. all the orbs over yonder? Oh, oh, whoops. I mean, should I, I use get... the orbs to attack something and not just to walk around? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, hey. um, that's all that's important. Can I get to the other orb? I, I can, but I used orb to get there. Um, let me move I'm sure here. You're going to be able to get out of goop. Yeah. yeah. I walked out of goop. Um, can you hit? I can do a little hit. There. Good hit. That's all I can that do. That does something. Remember you have, a, like, potions and fish or whatever. Steven, are you Ronald McDonald? I kind of look like Ronald McDonald. Oh, my gosh, yeah. Al, Ronald McDonald is a um, <laughs> fast food mascot. Are you being serious right now? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just... Now you don't know you... about... We have this place in the U.S. called McDonald's. He's, like, constantly at beef with this guy who's the king of burgers. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's not like your king. He's, like, your king. Yeah. With... <laughs> yeah, I assume you have him there. He's allowed. Uh, yeah, he's man, allowed. I no, we've only, there's only one true king here. God, I took a lot of damage in that fight. You did take a lot of damage, but we did it good. Ooh, I got a green. I can oh. restore eight hit, hit points, but I'm going to pass on that to get two magic power. I, rest I restored HP because I'm worried I'm going to die if I don't. Yeah, you should do that. Um, restore HP, I mean, not die. I'm going to... I'm going to augment Scorching the, the, the Leap because it's a better move. Smash does a ton of damage, but Leap, like, moves me around. Oh, there's a fish. A fish? Where fish? It was a, a, a prickly puffer. A puffer? I barely knew her. <laughs> Gain a powerful hey. new binding or send one if your bar is full. Oh, cool. This is just a good thing. I'm down for I just a good so. thing. So you're at the beginning, you're not attuned to any specific thing. Because, like... All like you you start with your ability, your physical and your magic all zero. So you can take any binding that you want, I guess. Cuz in my head I'm like, "Ah, oh, I should be using physical." But like it I don't think it matters. Yeah. You start to kind of neutral until this, you cover out. Yeah, I'm assuming that really the 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 classes only determine like what you start with. Did everybody get book? Book? Uh, uh what book? Over here, over here. Book. Oh, apparently. What book? I think it's kind of like the fish thing where there's only one. Oh, there's yeah, only one I book. Didn't, I, I book. did not book. Oh, I'm sorry. It healed me. I mean, I oh, you're, okay. the, you're the one that has needed healed. Well, you need yeah. heals. That's true. Um, but you yeah, can we heal should, at the man. Yeah, we should definitely see the man. Hey, two. Two out of three. Yeah, I could definitely afford to heal here. Um... Combat end, the best you can set. On defeating an enemy, 25% chance to gain one he, will. The carver really needs to work on his customer service skills. Yeah, he's a bit of a dick. Just saying. I'm assuming we all see different vestiges. Mm -hmm. So the, I have yeah. one that says, if I buy it, you and your allies are immune to rooted and ensnared. Which I, the, we haven't seen are, yet, but seems helpful. What are vestiges again? These are the items, right? On the right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to grab... A thing that gives me plus 10 max HP and deals 75 damage when I to anything that hits me. That seems good. So um, these are like passive buffs yes, as opposed yeah, to active yeah. buffs. I'm going to I'm going to get the withered um, tracks. We I don't know that we've seen rooted or ensnared, but if I buy this, none of us can be affected by it and then it's just ooh. done. Uh, I love, good I luck. I love looking in the corner and seeing Spider-Man. <laughs> Well, here goes something. This will either we're either gonna do it or we're gonna end our run. Nah, nah, we got it. Yeah, we got this. Any any cool stuff? There is nothing cool. <laughs> I gotta think about what I want to do here. I'm getting the impression that you uh you don't get 
cool stuff in combat. Ooh! Soul shield. So the red circle means damage, right? That's... Mm-hmm. So the thing in the middle is not a boss. Or, well, it's the boss, but it just spits out enemies. Is uh, that okay. correct? Well, no, it has a 4,800 point health bar. Well, then... But we can't target it, can we? I think so. Uh, oh, wait, we can target it. Never mind. Yeah, so... Shoot. I'm going to hit purple boy and this guy i'm only taking three damage right now so i'm like mm, this is probably fine 55 damage in a small area inflicts five stacks of burn okay let's uh do this let's inflict the burn and let's let's cultivate a thing oh um and then so let's I, uh, smash. Good. Let me smash. I'm only Wait, taking three damage. Not, so is this he, is fine. Has he taken any damage? Well, we box? haven't we haven't hit play yet. So now he will. Oh wait, no, that definitely did read a zero, didn't it? Yeah. That's not good. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. Well, <laughs> either there's a trick. To beating this, or we have to defeat the monsters first? Maybe, yeah. I don't know. Alright, let's jump over here. Get my plant. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep bashing. How's everybody looking on health? Oh, wait, no, I can see it. Never mind. Um. Uh. Okay. Okay. Well, this is. Blink. This is right. fine. I'm actually gonna. Do I want to use this? I don't know. Oh no! I've been soul shackled. So we still haven't managed to do any damage to the fella. Holy shit! Wait. Why am I gonna get thirty-four damage? What's that about? Uh, yeah, I'm, I, I'm gonna take 35 also, so I want to find out why and not do that. Is this this whole shackled thing? I'm gonna jump over here. Requires target. That is my target. 41 damage. What? That's bad. <laughs> That's extremely not good. Wait, so why? Uh, those, those, how do you have any? Those guys are so close to dead. How do you have any will left? Uh, no. Okay. Are we all gonna get hit? Cause I. Oh, okay. No, that. Ooh, nice. Okay, that's perfect. Oh, I oh well, as in yeah, no, I had like one left. Oh, okay. Um. Well, now I'm only gonna take twenty-two. <laughs> yeah, I'm done 25. I think it's this soul linked thing. That's what he's. Yeah. Oof. That hurt a bit. That hurt a fair amount, um, yeah. But we are damaging the boss now. Okay, so that's what it was about. Um, I'm gonna plant a flower here. And then I'm gonna walk over here and take an orb and hit him with my good move. And then I'm going to take four damage. Well, whatever. All right. Now I'm going to take zero. Hell yeah. Yeah. Oh, I did zero damage to him. That was not ideal. Uh... Man, you uh, jump in. I can blink. Ow. <laughs> Are you free of the the <clears throat> mire? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Hmm. Um Yeah. I think so at this point we're not damaging it anymore, right? Like that's Yeah, I think I so think now you're right. we, have we have to, to focus. take out all the enemies. Okay. Okay. 
This is going okay. I should move out of the way a little bit. Yeah, we're halfway. That's... Um... Mm, yeah. Alright. I'm gonna take zero damage this turn. That's pretty good. Okay. Um, all the orbs are down yonder. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's uh, just keep... It's saying that I'm gonna be dead. Oh no. Oh, me too. Um... Okay. <laughs> I, uh, I hate that. Is there anything... Oh, no, I'm good. Never mind. Oh, I can Love do things that. again. Uh, let me make a plant. Or I'm actually... Good. Yeah, I'm gonna make a plant. I'm gonna make a plant. I'm gonna make a plant. Yeah, we have... I have three stacks of Soul Shackle. Which means I take 75% more damage. Oh, that'll do it. Hmm. Well, that's bad. Yeah, by the looks of it, we get through his current amount of dudes, and then we get a, a turn to hit him, and then we just need to kill him in that one hit before he summons more dudes. But we did yeah. more than half of his health in one hit anyway, in one turn anyway, so I think we should be fine. Just yeah, need I to deal with these guys. I don't know if we could survive more dudes. Mm. So we, we better burn them down. Uh, okay. Soul Shackle. Um, also, almost the entire thing is covered in, in goo at this point. Which, you know. Yeah, currently it's like, you will be dead. And I'm like, well, that's neat. So who should I be attacking? Are we currently doing damage to the chest? Kill the, kill the... Uh, we are, actually, yeah. Yeah. Somehow, I don't know. It's not a lot. Uh, also, um, I'm going to die next turn. Don't love oh, that. Oh, I'm gonna die this turn. We, um, we, there's all, there's too much goo. Gain Is it shield. better to be in the goo? Then no, to... It's definitely not. Well, but anywhere I stand here, I'm gonna die. So my only oh, option is to I get in the goo. Oh, I understand what you're saying. So maybe you should. I'm, I'm gonna try and get in the goo because I'm gonna die if I stay here. Yeah. Yeah, I just run through I'm, the goo and. I'm no. still gonna. I'm still gonna die in the yeah. goo. <laughs> oh well. Um. Remember to use consumables if you got them. I don't have but, any. Um, I'm gonna die. Um, Who knows? Maybe we'll be okay. Yeah, I, I doubt it. Maybe if we pray. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, I can do like I can do two moves here. I can sit. I can use the <laughs> sit mode in the goo. Well, try just sitting in the goo. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. All right, I hit go. I'm sitting in the goo. Yeah. I hit go to. Oh. I died. There we go. Oh yeah. my god. Wow. Jesus. Woo. Wow. Your journey ended in the Radiant Market. And we're all crying. Oh, our victory emote is set to crying by default. That's why we're all crying. <laughs> yeah. Or I guess it's not a victory emote. It's a defeat emote. Uh, defeat emote. So that was, that was interesting. Because um, I've never played a turn-based cooperative roguelike. Like, that's very unique. Um, mm. and I think the thing that was, was interesting is like, you're doing all of your stuff and then you're just waiting for all of your teammates to finish and then everything plays out and you have to, you know, hope that you're going to be in a good position. It's also interesting to see like how much damage you're going to take change as things happen. Yeah. yeah I mean, it, it seems like there's a lot of potential for, for very tactical play, which we didn't do because we're very new at it and still figuring it out. But like, you know. It kind of reminds me of like, it reminds me a little bit of when I was in high school and played World of Warcraft and did like raid bosses. 
yeah. where you have to coordinate with a group of people to like figure out your strategy and execute on it. But you have the, you have all the time to like figure that out and as you're playing the game because it's turn based. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, it's it's really unique. Yeah, for I sure. Like it a lot. Um, cool. I uh, like being Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, thank thanks again uh, for joining me. I appreciate it, and uh, and then also thanks to uh, my my buddy for sending me some keys over so we could give this a shot. Inkbound is in early access, but it is available now on Steam, so you can check it out.